All right, what is going on, ladies and gentlemen? My name is The Saved One, and today what we're going to be doing is the Week 10 Challenges. Now, one quick thing just to get out of the way before we start is that in the description, there is uh, timestamps to the different challenges that I'm going to be doing here today. Now, these challenges, they look, you know, some of them are challenging, but some of them they're pretty easy. So I think that we should start off with the free challenges and let's get into this first one, launch through flaming hoops with the cannon. All right, so now before we quickly get into this, I do wanna show you where all of the cannons are. It's gonna be on the screen right now. If you do wanna pause the video, take a screenshot of it, do whatever you need to do in order to remember that uh, this is exactly where uh, the cannons are, as well as where all of the flaming hoops are. That's gonna be on your screen right now as well. Now, this first cannon challenge is gonna be right here. Uh, this is exactly where I am. It's on this little uh, hill here. And you got to take a cannon from there or there and bring it all the way over here. Break the railing as well and try and land a cannon shot. Now, I've tried this twice already and I cannot get it for the life of me. I may have learned now. Got to go all the way above and then just shoot. And there we go. That's one hoop. We're looking for three. Let's go to the next one. All right, a little bit up and fire. That's number two, baby. Let's look for our third flaming hoop. All right, so the cannon is here. Flaming hoop is here. We got to get into it. Now, we got to go way above. I've realized this by now. Let's do it. Way above into the hoop. I did it. Woo. Flaming hoop is around here. Cannon is right there. We've completed that challenge. Let's move on to the next one. All right, so this next challenge is a three-part challenge, and it's pretty simple. Uh, we've been getting some kind of hard challenges over these past couple weeks, so now it's kind of a nice little refresher just to be like, all right, let's do a pretty easy challenge. And uh, the first part of this th three-part challenge is just, just to collect some wood. And my first thought was to go into like a, a forest just kind of in the middle of nowhere. But on the Fortnite Master website, we actually have a full-on guide of how to uh, do all of these challenges and it's all in written form. So I, over on the website, they say that they're, the easiest places to get wood are one of two areas. So D Dusty Divot, which is obvious, right? There's a lot of wood over there. Or there is a spot near Happy Hamlet. I believe the indicator is showing right there. And um, yeah, so it's just to collect wood. Let's uh, try and get this challenge done here. By the way, you also do have to collect 500 wood in a single match, so keep that in mind. All right, and there it was, 500 wood in a single match. Let's move on to the second part of this challenge, which is, which is I believe, is to collect 400 100 brick in a single match. All right, so the second part, like I said before, is just to harvest stone in a single match. Now, the two places that I thought of was this place right here, and around fatal fields and on the website that's exactly what we say is that there's quarries near pleasant park and uh fatal fields so we're just gonna get hacking away here i'm pretty sure there are people over at the quarry to the north so just in case i do have uh some, some weapons if i do need to uh kill anyone but let's try and get this challenge done all right, and that was it. Yeah, that was pretty simple. Yeah, go to a quarry, start farming some stone, and then after, you know, you kind of excavate half of the area, you'll eventually get it. So that was uh, this the second part to this three-part challenge. Now, obviously, the third part, if we've already collected wood and brick, is to collect steel. And you already know where I'm going to go for that. I'm probably just going to go to uh, Junk Junction. So I'll meet you guys there. Now, the only reason why I'm a little bit sad right now is because the battle bus literally started at Junk Junction. So I'm going to go to the second place where I think that there's a lot of metal and it's even on the, the Fortnite Master website is uh, over at the soccer stadium where I believe it's all of the fences around the stadium itself are metal. So they give you also a lot of metal as well. So uh, yeah, there's also bleachers inside of the stadium too. So let's get right into there. All right, so that was definitely a lot of metal, and now I'm getting shot at, which is really good. So what I've learned is that bleachers, they suck. So don't, don't, don't do the bleachers, because they, they only give you uh, four metal. But the scaffolding on the top, that's what gives you a lot. It gives you a bit around, like, almost 20 per scaffolding. So definitely do that. Let's head on over to the next challenge. 
All right, so for this next challenge, you do have to eliminate three opponents in Tilted Towers and the block. Now, obviously it doesn't have to be three per, but um, yeah, just trying to eliminate three opponents. Now, I love to go here instead of Tilted Towers. This building is a lot of fun to go to because it's pretty like uncontested. Like I think there, there are a lot of buildings that are just like, oh my goodness, super contested. All right, that was one. Now, I also wanted to check out this week's uh, block, and it actually looks really cool. Oh my goodness. This looks like something straight out of like, like an Avengers movie. This is so cool. So yeah, let's try and get two kills here. Because that's two. Woo! Oh my god, I got messed up, dude. <laughs> And I also completed another achievement. So I'll quickly explain both achievements, what I just did right there. Of course, I just completed uh, the third and final kill inside of Tilted Towers. And you have to get a kill on someone within five meters away from them. And that's exactly what I did right there. So hopefully that helps you out a little bit. But let's head on over to the next challenge. So I ended up doing this challenge earlier as well. So here's that kill. All right, so this challenge is a little bit more fun where you actually have to search a uh, treasure map. And a lot of people, if you do the challenges, are very familiar with this type of format. You got to search a treasure map in a certain area and then go to another area to find where the uh, the star, the battle pass star is. So this first one is around the basketball court from what I see in the picture here. It's right here. You can see it already right here. You can see me and all these other people are landing here. We're going to search for it. And that's pretty obvious on, on where that is. So, uh... I believe it's right here. Yeah, it's right over there. So, all right, so it says the battle pass door is somewhere here. It's right here. I can see it. There we go. So we followed the treasure map in Junk Junction, and this is exactly where the spot is. It's on top of this rock. There's the fork over there, kind of the, the flag-looking thing here. And then there's the rock right there over here so let's head on over to the next challenge all right so our second last challenge is to deal damage with an infantry rifle or a heavy assault rifle now we all know that the heavy assault rifle is very very common and uh yeah i'm just gonna be doing a little bit of damage with it and then show you the clip and then we'll get on into our last challenge weak 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 Nice, nice. Team behind him, team behind him. Careful, yeah. careful, careful. Alright, so for this next challenge, you do have to deal damage to opponents after using a volcano vent within 10 seconds. So I did do a little bit of it, about 67 damage, just to kind of show you guys what that looks like. This is our last and final challenge. Let me just show you guys real quick what that looks like. 48. 19. <laughs> 48 and 19. Did you get it? <laughs> yeah, I almost did. Like, challenge is almost complete. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. As usual, if you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the sub button and click that bell to get notifications. And if you liked the video, be sure to show it to your friends, family, church group, dog, or other loved ones we did not mention. From over here at Fortnite Master, my name is The Saved One. We love you guys, and have a great rest of your day. Peace.